Hey everybody, it's your Q&A video that you've all been waiting for. You ask the questions and I'm answering. Let's try again. Hey everybody, it's Brittany. It's time for that Q&A video we've all been wanting to see. You asked the questions, I answered them. So, here we go. I'm still in the film, huh? Still in the frame. Michael Dot Murray asked, how old are you? Is that like a question that you just don't ask them? Like a woman is like, it's almost like the same question as like, what is your weight? Right? Like what's your age? What do I, what age do I look? I'm 29. Um... I will be 30 on January 10th. I'm gonna be halfway to 60. JR underscore MTFU asked, do you prefer freshwater or saltwater fishing? Saltwater. Saltwater fishing is definitely my preference. Fishing Princess Kaya asked a question. First of all, before I even like answer her question, this girl is incredible. She asked, or she said, no question, just wanted to tell you how proud I how proud of you I am launching your company and how successful you've been. This little girl. She already has this passion for fishing that you can't even describe. She's always wanting to know how to do this, how to do that. She's wanting to learn. She's wanting to be like part of it. She's wanting to fish with everybody so she can completely just watch and see how everything is done and how it's, it's just, I hope one day I can introduce her to my little girls because my oldest really isn't into fishing that much, but my youngest, they'd be like besties. Like, you just know, like, that person, that person would be, like, inseparable. That's, like, my new friend, Shayna, all the way over in freaking California. I mean, you meet these awesome people, and they're literally 3,000 miles away. They're like, why? Why? She said, why are you genuinely so nice and cool? Girl. Why are you so nice and cool? Like, we were meant to be friends. Love you. I don't know, I try to, I really am one of these people, I'm super bubbly, I'm friendly, I can make friends with anybody. What is the point in being boring? Or what is the point in being just like, ugh, I don't know if I could like be her friend. Like. Shit. Be like, hey, what's up? Let's go fishing. Let's go do something. Brian Sherwood asked, what will be your role at Hook Charters? I am so excited about this opportunity um, for Hook Charters. I'm actually going to be a first mate on the 32 foot yellowfin. Uh, so I will be rigging up your baits helping you drop to the bottom, helping you reel up if you need it, assisting you along the entire trip, being there to joke around, have a good time, have a great experience. That's what I'm here for. So I cannot wait to be a part of your fishing experience in Destin. That is like the most exciting thing for me. Do you fish fresh water? So yes, I fish both. Um, fresh water and salt water, but more salt water um, than fresh water now. This is by B Street Black. Why are you such a cutie? I don't know. I don't know how to answer these questions. That's just me. Personality wise, I don't know. Maybe I'm just a cutie. Okay. J. Co. Quinn. 
and it asks, do you ever get seasick? Yes, I do get seasick. I only get seasick though if I have drank way too much alcohol the night or if I'm dumb enough to actually not eat food in the morning but take a medicine so I'm taking medicine on an empty stomach which made me seasick which I've done recently or um, but it doesn't matter you could be puking off the side of the boat but as soon as that reel starts screaming you're like BAM to the rod and the reel and you're just reeling 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 and then all of a sudden you're like oh shit I'm not even seasick anymore until the fun and excitement is over and then the boat starts swinging again and you're like oh man I'm seasick again <laughs> let's see I am W62 asked big plans for the new year so yes um, we are actually moving into our apartment in Dustin at Going back to my current job right now, I am a customer service manager at a car dealership, so December is the busiest month for us, so I will be working um, up until New Year's Day and then probably just resting um, from being go, 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 constant, non-stop busy, which sounds so beautiful right now. I could just totally take it. So R. Hansen 197-67888 asked, how many times a week do you get to fish? As of right now, it's like maybe once or twice a month. Um, starting February, it will be seven days a week. I'm so excited. Like, I don't even know how to talk about it. It's like, it makes me want to cry. I mean, I'm so excited. Okay, so, let's see. Mark Sherman said, Since you're out with fish all the time, do you like eating seafood? Or do you like a good steak, too? <laughs> well, trigger fish is delicious. One of my faves. I actually enjoy eating amberjack too. Everybody's like, ooh, don't eat that. That's not really a good fish to eat. It's delicious. Absolutely love it. And if you fry anything, it's good. A steak? Pfft. Put a steak on the broil. Give it to me medium rare. Phenomenal. But yes, I love food. I love steak. love seafood. Great question. I can answer that one. That one was easy. Thanks, Mark. Okay. John Michael Kenny asked, Hi, Brittany. What would be your dream fishing trip and what would be your catch of fit? So my dream fishing trip would be to go to Costa Rica. My dream fish to catch would be a rooster fish. They're so freaking cool looking. And I'm like so envious when I see people post with a rooster fish. I'm just like, I want to catch one so bad. I just want to catch one. Already read that one. So tone nine zero two one zero underscore asked keto or not to keto. Oh, that almost sounded like a Mexican like taquito, taquito taco bell, you know. Let's see. Um I would say keto. I the last time I dieted was on a keto diet and I dropped so much weight so so fast. Completely leaned up, um I was cutting I had com so much definition um, and I felt better like I mentally and physically felt better when I was on the keto diet but I will say it makes you super tired at the beginning because you're not taking it in any like carbohydrates it's mainly just straight uh, protein and fiber uh, so that was so Darren Luce said who inspires you there's a lot of people um, that I could put on that list, but my daughters actually inspire me more than anything in the world. They're 12 and 9. Um, they're absolutely beautiful. They have personalities like their mother, you know. <laughs> Sometimes I'm like, oh my god. Can't get mad because that's something I'd do or that's something I'd say, but 
they inspire me to be a better mother, a better person. Um, they inspire me to challenge myself, challenge them. Um, they just, they're just inspirations within themselves. So my daughters are who inspire me. Or Askama 77 said, do any of your fans slash followers, hold on, I can't read, so let's rewrite, <laughs> let's reread that. Do you follow any of your fans slash followers? Could I be one? And he has like a little, you know, like a, hey, I'm right here, can you, can you, hey, can you, can you pick me, can you pick me? So let's just um, go right on into Instagram here. Here I come, oh, I'm going to come follow your page for you. Let's see. Do do. So we have O S. Did I press it? Guess what? Yes, I do. And you're not the only one I've actually followed. Steve Taylor, if you could do only one thing for the rest of your life, what would you do? Like, what would I do? Simple answer: fish. All right, William Knoll said, do you like to fish for largemouth and smallmouth bass? Yes, I do like to bass fish. Um, I haven't actually been bass fishing in a while. I think it was in maybe June. No, July for ICAST was the last time I actually went bass fishing besides peacock bass fishing when I went with Real Deal Adventures, which was so awesome. If you haven't booked with Real Deal, just just go book right now. Reel in a peacock, let me tell you. Let's see. Bert Simmons, have you ever caught a tarpon over 80 pounds? So I've actually never caught a tarpon. I hope that when I fish Destin um, more often throughout the charter, I'll be able to actually land a tarpon. Um, I think that would be so cool. I think they're awesome. 